It's 7 a.m. and check out the moon. Where's my finger? There it is. Check out the moon right there. It's probably a little hard to see. Oh, there we go. But it's huge. Looks like a full moon and it's enormous. I went out after work to do some Christmas shopping and I'm just heading home. It's almost 7.30 and I uh, just wanted to show you the moon. You saw it this morning and now you're seeing it again. Big bright moon. It's not coming up as well on the camera as I would like it to. It's not focusing, but you get the drift. Hi YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. Had to think about that for a minute. I'm filming at 9.20 at night because I just got home less than an hour ago, I'd say. After work, I went straight to shopping. I had a package I had to return at UPS, and then I went to TJ Maxx, of course. Can't leave the house without going there. I went to Specs, which is a local liquor store to pick up a few gifts for people, and maybe some champagne for myself. And then I went to World Market, where I picked up quite a few things. And I always spend way too much time at both TJ Maxx and World Market. Those are my nemesises, nemesi. What's the plural of nemesis? Hey Siri, what's the plural of nemesis? Okay, I found this on the web for what's the plural of nemesis. Check it out. That wasn't helpful. Anyway, I'll show you a couple of things that I got, things that I got for myself, but I'm not gonna show things I got for other people because I'm pretty sure those people are watching. The people I buy for, I don't know, I may need to reassess my close circle because I think they're all stalkers. Sometimes I'll be talking to them and they'll start talking about something that I've never talked to them about and it's because they saw it in a video and that's weird. Baron is scratching at the door, excuse me. All right, both of the dogs are here now so we can commence advent calendar time as soon as we're ready. Where was I? I don't remember. I'm gonna show you what I got. I was standing in line at the liquor store at about, I don't know, 6.30 at night or so. And these were standing right next to me and I picked them up some sour gummies from Haribo. Haribo has the best gummies. Could anyone possibly disagree with that? I don't think so. Then everything else I got is from World Market. I got this little tin. Like I said, they have the best stocking stuffers. I may have gotten one of these for someone else on my Christmas list. I'm out of wine. Why do bad things happen to good people? And I got these Tate's chocolate chip cookies. Bobster92 told me about these. It seems like every time I talk about food, it's because of Bobster92. In our private messages, Yota Style has been teasing me that Bobster is getting so many shout outs and she's getting none. So shout out to Yota Style, hey. I'm so uncool. I also got some earrings, and these little things. They sort of look like grape clusters a little bit, but I thought they were just simple and dainty. Maybe I'll wear them. After I'd left home this morning, I realized that I forgot to put on any jewelry. My friend Jill Maurer, who is a fine jewelry designer and has a channel on YouTube that I'll link below, and I'll also link Bob Stern Yota. I think she will be very disappointed in me, but she'll get over it. And then maybe my favorite thing that I picked up at World Market is this. These are some sticky notes with fantastical animals on them, and this is a new product that was just recently released, and this is what it looks like. So it's got the little book, and those are the stickies, and it has these cool black and white drawings of all these animals. It's very zoological, natural history, which I'm very much into. There's the back of it. It was $10. Now I bought off Amazon I bought these two sticky note list pads from Post-it, and there was a third one that came with this, and those were $10. So I feel like this sounds like it's a little expensive, $10 for these stickies, but when you consider that, I think it's a good price. Also, if any of you are into Star Wars, 
Office Depot, Office Max, has these cool pens. This one is a gel ink pen, Darth Vader, uh, but they also had some fountain pens. And they had Darth Vader, R2-D2, Yoda, and I don't know the name of the character and that the other one was, but it was the spherical guy with the little floating head that's kind of like R2-D2, but a newer model, I think. I really don't know those movies at all. But these nice Schaefer pens were only $20, so if you've got somebody on your list who likes to write and they're into Star Wars, there's a gift idea for you. You're welcome. And while I was shopping, I carried my bag of the day. Let me show you that. It is this nondescript gray tote. I picked this up in Italy when we were in Florence. I got it at the leather market there, and the inside is just the other side of the leather. It's uh, raw. It's really cool. It has this little pocket in it. Otherwise, it's just a big floppy open hole. And it was very inexpensive. I bought like three of them. I think it was $20 each maybe, maybe even 10 or 15. It was very inexpensive. And I think they're just beautiful. And I always get compliments on these when I wear them. I love them so much. And then of course I have my new Coach Twilly on here with the party animals. Super cute. Oh, and I have the Tea of today, yesterday. This was the, oh now I don't remember. It was some kind of cookie, sorry. It's like a gingerbread cookie, I think. Gingerbread shortbread, that doesn't make sense. It tastes very much like a cookie. It tastes like a sugar cookie. I'm not sure I like that in a tea. Like a shortbread sugar cookie. They're similar, aren't they? It has a very distinct flavor of the shortbread cookie. It's good if you like that, and I do like shortbread cookies, but I don't know, it's a little, Kind of throws me a little when I'm drinking it rather than crunching on it. Not sure about that one. I think someone just joined me in my chair. Who is it? Oh, look who it is! Just in time for Advent calendar time. Boy, what a coincidence. Is it a coincidence, Roxy? Oh, I see. That's why she's here. Roxy, do you know what time it is? Why, it's Advent calendar time. Which one should we open first? Let's start with Sugarfina again. Today is day 12, and I already know what this is because it has lips on it, and I'm familiar with Sugarfina lip candies. These are the Sugarfina Hot Lips. I don't even have to look at the package to tell you that. Oh, maybe they're not the Hot Lips. It says Sugar Lips. Pucker up to these sweet and sour gummy lips and mouth-watering flavors of strawberry, cherry, and watermelon. I've had the ones that have a little fire to them called Hot Lips, and I guess that's not what these are. So these sound pretty good. Even so, I'm gonna pass them along to a friend. Now let's do tea. Let's see. Roxy wants to skip the tea, don't you, Roxy? Where is door number 12? I think it might be right behind your head. There it is. This one is called Sunny Sea Citrus Immune Boost. It has apple, carrots, pineapple, orange peel, pieces of orange, hibiscus blossoms, lemon peel, pink peppercorns, safflower blossoms, and some other stuff. Sounds good, I like citrusy stuffs. By the way, a couple of people have asked me now if I am aware that my videos end so abruptly. And since a couple of people have asked, that means probably more than that are wondering. So I will tell you the answer. All will be revealed. The answer is yes. The videos end abruptly because they end when my fingers get chomped off by these guys. She looks innocent, doesn't she? She's not. All right, number 12 is that silver one back there. I'm gonna have to move the lights to get to it, so. Hang on. I didn't realize my bag of yesterday was still here. I need to put that away. This has two gifts. This is an empty tin for storing tea. It's light safe and air safe. 
and then this is a little spoon it's a one tablespoon measuring spoon for measuring scoops of tea out of the tea bags and into my fancy teapot. Both items are from David's Tea and I will link them below. Dog cookie advent calendar time. I see door number 12 right there. Mm -hmm. 